how far are you willing to go to do it all? And I don't care what anybody says, all bodybuilders are fucked up. All powerlifters are fucked up. All strongmen are fucked up. They're not bad people. We just like it. There's nothing wrong with it. We just like it. It's different. It's crazy. Fucking ludicrous. It's not six ounces of chicken and two cups of white rice. It's not cardio for 10 minutes. It's not an hour training session one time a week. It is fucking crazy consistent on every single level. One is not there, you won't win. If one of those factors is not there or you didn't dedicate all you had to it, you're gonna fucking lose. Because there's somebody out there willing to go to the fucking end in every single way possible to shove it down your fucking throat. And every person out there that's asking themselves, or young kid asking this, and a ton of people ask me questions, how do I become a pro? Let me tell you, you give it everything. You dedicate every single aspect of your life to it. That means you're going to sacrifice. You're going to sacrifice your time. You're going to sacrifice your mind, your body, your relationships everything for your dream. Why was I good at it? Because I was willing to sacrifice it all. That's all you have to do in anything you want to be great at. When it comes to business with me now, I'll sacrifice it all. That's how you become great at something. That's how you find out how good you are. There's just work to do. If you want to be great at anything, anything, you have to be willing to sacrifice. All of it, every aspect of your life. I was willing to do those things. And then you get young kids that wonder like, how do I become successful? Or what do I need to do to become famous? How are you famous? But just be you, like be yourself. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with being yourself? What's wrong with being a hardworking motherfucker that goes to work for his family? There ain't nothing wrong with that. So in order for me to be in this position, everybody, I had to go to the fucking end in bodybuilding. Had to be willing to do it. And then, in order for more to happen, whenever in 2016, whenever I came back, I had to be open and willing to be myself and talk like I do and not give a fuck what people say about me. You just have to pick what 16 hours out of the day you want to work and work the ever-loving fuck out of them. Yeah. I don't care if your 16 hours are from 6 a.m. on or from 6 p.m. on. Not five days a week, not six days a week, seven, motherfucker.
Pick your 16 and go to fucking work and do it with a relentless, relentless feeling inside of you. Everybody's here for a reason. You're on this planet for a reason. So why not be the best motherfucker you can be so that you become great? Yep. Be the best person you can be at something so whenever you are needed by somebody, you can affect their lives in a positive way. I can't stress to everybody enough to be yourself and just be good at what you're here to do. Yeah. And if you want more out of life, then go after it and you're going to have to sacrifice. <laughs>